Okay, guys, I'm going to do a quick little walkthrough of the Craftsman Versus Stack V20 work radio. Okay, so right now I have it plugged into the uh, wall power. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it on. Just click the main knob in once. The functions of the knobs work pretty good. The buttons are pretty smooth. It's IP64 rated for waterproof. So there you go, it's on, it's connected to my phone. You can hit the home menu, go back. From here you can hit FM, auxiliary, or go into your settings. The settings, you can go to Bluetooth settings, display settings, changing the brightness, um, sound, you can play with the equalizer, the treble, the bass, and the uh, system settings, clock, things like that. Okay, you can just go back. Oh, actually, with the back button. All right, so go to FM. Um, just turn that down. But the radio is pretty loud. It's surprisingly loud. For it's a two hundred dollar radio. I actually got it on sale for low at Lowe's for fifty dollars. Believe it or not. So, but very good radio. Um, four hundred watts, I believe. Six speakers. Like I said, four up here. It has two in the bottom. I believe those are the two subs right there. Here you have the clips for the Versa stack on either end. And then in the front and back, you can see this. This is for air, so it doesn't overheat. You have it in the front and back, and also to get the sound from the subwoofers. Very loud, very loud, very good. Um, I have it currently attached to the trade stack adapter to go into the trade stack. I'll be doing a review on that. So um, here you have the clips on top, so you can add other Versa stack attachments to the top. All right, in the back here you have a AC adapter plug. It's a little dark, but you can see it has a waterproof cover. Keep the dust and the water out. Then under here, clip that. You have a water seal all around. You have your auxiliary port. You have a USB charger. And here's where you can store extra batteries. You can store your AC adapter plug. And right here is where you would plug a battery in so you can charge it while it's plugged into the wall or you can run the radio off of the battery. Now, I don't have Craftsman batteries. But what I do have is an adapter here for another brand battery. And it works the same. I'll just clip this in first. And then I would take my battery here. And I would just slide this in here. And clip it all together. You can charge the battery, like I said. You can you have a little tray here, you can store your phone. Close the lid. That's about it.